What's up everyone? Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Before we begin, make sure to hit the like and subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button which is the bell icon. We're posting 4 videos every day so make sure to check back every single day. We're aiming for 20k subscribers and get a deal in the description if you haven't already. This is not financial advice. Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Let's begin. What's up guys, so just before we begin, make sure to hit the subscribe and bell icon. People aren't seeing our content and that's probably because you haven't hit the bell. Thank you again for all your support. We're so proud of the amazing community that we've built. So we're just taking a look at VeChain here and as we can see, it does look as though we are still stuck under somewhat of a resistance. Essentially, we've got a bit of a resistance looking something like this, haven't we? Which it looks as though we are actually still stuck under here. We haven't actually had the momentum over the past few days to actually back, come back up to the upside and break out of this level. And you know, that overall kind of falling wedge that we were looking at before is actually you know continuing to materialize as we can see we have actually rolled over here basically just chopping up in the middle of you know on this previous swing high ish area of this level here but then also you know we're still falling down making our you know lower low lower high lower low lower high lower low potentially we might come back down to the bottom of this macro channel here and get oversold before we do get that bounce for v chain but overall obviously we've had quite a bearish period over september with the wider markets as well, dragging VeChain down and the rest of the crypto market, obviously Bitcoin leading the way to the downside. And you can see here, obviously, in a very similar way to how we had a big, you know, descending wedge here. We've got a little bit of a descending wedge forming here and until we break it and retest the support, just like we did here and get that bounce, then we're probably going to see ourselves roll over, probably back down towards the bottom of this channel, we would say realistically, unless we can, you know, come to the upside and break this level of resistance, which is currently around, you know, that nine and a half ish cent area. Obviously, you can see we got back up towards that 10 cent level, which was a previous psychological level of support. Flipped into resist resistance. If we just draw this in, you'll be able to see what I mean. This level here, as you can see, a key level all across the board. Support here, flipped into resistance, then back into support again. And now it looks as though it's been flipped back into resistance. As we continue to do this consolidation, you know, you could say this is basically we're forming some kind of macro coiling kind of situation for VeChain here in all reality. Maybe looking something like this where we've got the, you know, the top and we've got our bottom. And we're just doing something like this until we're going to coil to a point and then potentially, you know, have that continuation for the bull run, which would be, you know, obviously be excellent. I mean, this would pretty much be a uh, a pretty decent move for VeChain if we did see ourselves breaking out of this as a kind of a bull flag coming up to that next Fibonacci extension around that 141. But you know, basically things have not been looking too hot because we've had a very bearish September in general, as we usually do. But we are optimistic that that bounce is coming pretty soon, just like we got it here with these big bullish divergences that we were looking at on a histogram, etc. You can see here we're getting down towards very oversold territory. And if we do come lower here, but we have a you know higher RSI, we'll have those bullish divergences as well. And in general, we don't think things are looking too bad for VeChain. So short term price predictions then. We probably would anticipate unless we break this level of resistance that we'll be coming back down towards the bottom of the channel, probably around 8.5 cents there. And then if we do get that bounce to the upside, we are looking to break this level of resistance at around nine and a half cents, 10 cents. If we can break through this level, back test some areas and then start to move on. Things are going to be looking good. We're obviously still stuck under our EMAs now that they're bearish again as well. So generally things are not looking too hot, but we are optimistic with a bounce in the market. We will see a lot of cryptos pump up. And as you can see here, you know, if we do start to get make our way back to the upside, we do want to see ourselves breaking our uh, our levels of uh, Fibonacci levels here. Our uh, EMA levels here, sorry, at around 10, 11 ish cents, which would obviously be, you know, very ideal because we do need to get back above our EMAs if we're going to see ourselves really moving to the upside again and, you know, flipping them back bullish. So basically, we do think VeChain, you know, things aren't looking too good in the short term, but we do think long term, we're probably going to get a decent bounce here because we are at the bottom of our channel yet again. And if we do get that bounce, we're going to be looking at some very nice price types by the end of the year, probably around 50 cents to $1. So that's it, guys. We'd like to thank everyone so much for their support. If you've got any questions or suggestions, please leave them down below. And don't forget to subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button, which is the bell icon to stay up to date with the four videos that we post every single day. Remember, if you want to support the channel more directly and get a ton of benefits and insight, as well as joining our growing community, consider the Patreon or YouTube membership down below. You can also sign up to our free Telegram via the description as well. All the links are in the description for affiliate links for discounts and free crypto. So go check them all out below. There's plenty of goodness on offer. Please like and subscribe. We are Crypto Maximalist.